Welcome back everybody to another Halloween product review. I want to start this video with a shout out to Josh the inflatable and tractor guy who clued me into this inflatable I'm going to show you. If you haven't seen Josh's channel yet, he has an insane amount of inflatables. It's, it's crazy, but he does reviews and videos on them, so make sure you check it out. Um, but he had sent me a picture of this inflatable that he purchased. He got it from Lowe's. I haven't seen it in Lowe's. I don't see it on their website, um, but I was very excited when I saw it. So I don't know if I should be thanking Josh or not, because it's actually caused me to rethink the whole entrance way to my you know, sort of haunt area. You know, originally I've been talking to you about doing like a ghost theme at the top of my driveway there. Out of the picture now, we're doing a pirate theme because I found this, well, he found this awesome pirate inflatable. Um, so I ordered it as soon as I saw it. Um, I ordered it from, um, what is this place called? Yardinflatables.com. And I ordered it on Tuesday. It's Friday. It just arrived, so they had super fast shipping. Um, but this is a haunted living product which I believe is a um, exclusive to Lowe's. So uh, it is what it is, but I'm glad I got it. I'm going to put this on the entranceway of my canopy, um, my little walkthrough canopy that I do um, with my other pirate ship inflatables around it. I think it's gonna make a cool little scene. I love how when you open up these boxes, it's got this neat little, you know, just the extra graphics, like a, a wooden box there. Makes it kind of fun. There is another box inside, so let's open up box number three now. And inside we have our inflatable. It looks like we've got, you know, the usual stakes with black cord. Some holiday living instructions. So I don't know holiday living. I guess that is a manufacturer. And then here is our inflatable. All right. I didn't actually read the box to you, but let's see. It's an air-blown projection pirate archway inflatable. Um, and I believe it's got one of those sort of fire and ice sort of looking um, effects on the head. I think that's gonna look pretty neat. I believe it's nine feet tall. I don't offhand, let's see what it says here. It says, features colorful flickering fire and ice light effect, um, energy efficient LEDs, self inflates in seconds, stakes, Etc. Okay, it doesn't show, it probably does show, I'm just obviously not seeing it, how tall it is, but I believe it's, oh yeah, here it is, nine feet tall. Let's go ahead and plug it in and see if that is a fact. On the bottom here, we have a very nice, um, large, powerful looking fan, which I love. The, you know, these kind with little pop out legs that stay in place, gives you that nice bit of airflow. You're not gonna get your leaves and whatnot caught in there. Now, the plug is on the left side as you're looking at it from the front. I know that's kind of important to some people when you're setting up things, because um, you don't want to be running this cord across the edge here to get to the left side and have someone trip over it. But for our purposes, let's just plug it in and see what happens. Oh. Did I tell you wrong? I think I did tell you wrong. I have got it going up backwards, I think. Or maybe not. I don't know. Yes. It's on the right side. No, no, it's on the left. <laughs> All right, it was on the left, sorry. Okay, but there we go. He stands up very well on his own, you know, is he gonna tip over maybe a little bit? My driveway's got a big slope right here, so. Um, but he, say, he stands pretty well. He inflated very fast, so I was very impressed with that. Um, and he's relatively tall. You know, I'm about 6'4", and I can almost fit beneath it without having to duck. Definitely has the interesting looking uh, fire and ice effect on this, the head there. I love it. I love these little accents here. Let's go ahead and pull the camera in and take a closer look. All right, the little torches on the side are pretty neat. I would almost, however, have liked to see those little side bones as inflatable bits as well, instead of just painted on. And it looks like the flame is a little dark, but otherwise, the head certainly lights up. That effect is very eye-catching. I can't wait to see what people think 
when they approach it. It's got a fun little hat up there. Coordinates with the little red streamers. Overall, I think it is a beautiful effect. All right, so he's a pretty awesome prop. The only thing that kind of concerns me is the rattling sort of sound that is coming from um, my fan. It almost sounds like an air conditioning um, unit going. It's got that just, it just sounds awfully loud and I don't think that is probably normal. So I hope it's not broken, but um, it's working and it inflated like we saw in just seconds. Now let's see about deflating. First I'm gonna turn it around just so you can see the backside. It's definitely a one-sided inflatable. I mean, there's really nothing to see on the back. Looks like here's the um, lighting unit there. We do have some of the um, tethering bits here on you know, my shoulder height. The only thing, I don't see a zipper on the archway portion itself. There is likely one right down here. Let me go ahead and unplug it. We'll see how fast it deflates. All right, there is the one zipper here. So let's go ahead and, oh wow, okay. That is a very large zipper. Um, I'm not used to seeing it go halfway around the archway there. On the other side, if there is one, I don't see it. So that's a little strange. Definitely don't see it. So, you know, if, I don't know, if it's LED, so I'm told you can't really change the light bulbs if they go out. Hopefully it won't ever, but if you do need to do something, if the lights eventually go out, you're gonna have a little bit of difficulty getting through the one hole there. But there he is. That's it for today, I guess. So stay tuned. Make sure you come back toward Halloween to see what I do and have them in my display. And uh, make sure you're subscribed for my other videos, my walkthroughs, DIYs, and uh, product reviews. So that'll do it for today. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Happy haunting. something you don't see every day.